More than 100 cars stolen in Milwaukee, but it took only one person to stop it from continuing. And now police are looking into a tow truck company that may have been in the business of auto theft. Chip Brewster has more on them and their rather ironic name. 28-year-old Tyrone Aikens is making his way through the court system after being charged with two counts of theft involving vehicles. According to the criminal complaint, as a tow truck driver for Can't Stop Towing, he routinely drives around the city looking for vehicles that need to be towed or junked. However, he was recently caught stealing two cars red-handed when a woman witnessing Aikens called police because she believed something was not right. Aikens was caught, the cars returned, and he even admitted to police when he towed the two vehicles away, he was in fact stealing them. But that's not where this crime ends. As police investigated the now apparently defunct towing company, a search warrant shows they recovered four vehicles on the lot of Can't Stop Towing. These vehicles had been reported stolen. A little more digging led police to the business's scrapyard of choice, Seven Stars Recycling. Another business apparently shut down. That same search warrant reveals Can't Stop Towing had sold more than 1,600 cars to the junkyard. Of those, police were able to confirm 118 vehicles were reported stolen one to three days prior to when Seven Stars Recycling had bought them. All of those had been taken within the last year. That leaves questions about just how far back the crimes could go. Now, Aikens has only been charged with the theft of two vehicles. As for the other, at least 116. As far as we could find, no one else has been charged. And police have not told us if they are still investigating or not, or if charges are on their way. Reporting live in the newsroom, Chip Brewster, Fox 6 News. Thank you, Chip. And new tonight, Azana Salon and Spa plans to reopen on December 1st. Authorities say Radcliffe Hospital.